The 2017 Atlantic hurricane season was one of the deadliest on record. Hurricanes Harvey, Maria and Irma caused billions of dollars worth of damage, wrecking entire communities in their wake. According to the Center for Climate and Energy Solutions, storms have increased in intensity over the past three decades, fueled by warmer oceans and made worse by rising sea levels. It's something researchers at the School of Marine and Atmospheric Science in Miami have spent years studying. This is the sustained facility. Professor Brian House has no doubt that climate change is playing a role. It's not a matter of belief. This is not some political philosophy. It's not a, re it's not a religion. It's, this, is, this is facts. It's happening. It's going to get worse unless we do something now. Some models predict storms may become less frequent but stronger, slower and wetter. Experts use the accumulated cyclone index to measure storms and the Atlantic Ocean is in the midst of its worst stretch on record. Despite all the evidence that climate change is a factor in making hurricanes stronger, there are still those that don't believe it. President Trump and many powerful Republicans fall into that camp. But researchers say it's now time to reinforce vulnerable communities and prepare for the worst. Assistant Professor Landolf Rod Barbaragos says officials should invest in seawalls, restore barrier islands and build stronger structures. So we know that we have uh, some reserves into our uh, structures that uh, we need to enhance. So it's definitely something that we have to start building upon it. It's critical because uh, we know that uh, the probability of something happening, something devastating, is high. The Atlantic hurricane season begins on June the 1st, but the National Hurricane Center has already named it the first storm. It's since weakened, but if the predictions are accurate, it could be a sign of things to come. Andy Gallagher, Al Jazeera, Miami, Florida.